What's up guys? Hope everybody's doing well and having a great day. In this video, I wanted to share with you guys a rare warning issued by NASA. NASA says falling satellite poses a risk of harm on planet Earth. Article dated April 18th of 2023 over here at spaceexplored.com. And the event that they're talking about is supposed to occur today on April 19th, sometime today, somewhere on Earth. But that's the big mystery. They don't know where. And if it does come into the atmosphere above a population, area this is what you could see in the sky especially if it's in the the nighttime sky it may also look like that if it's in the daytime sky what the object is is a retired satellite known as RHESSI that's been in orbit since 2002 and according to their predictions it's going to make re-entry sometime today they go on to say that a 660 pound satellite will make an uncontrolled re-entry through the earth's atmosphere around 9 30 p.m. Eastern Time on Wednesday, April 19th. But there is a window of 16 hours that this thing could come in on either side of that 930 estimate. So be on the lookout, especially right now until the end of the day. More than likely, this will come into the atmosphere over the ocean somewhere. But if it does not, and it comes into the atmosphere above land, especially a populated area, have your cameras ready because the sky could look something like that. And you may also want to have your cameras ready if you're down in the, the southern hemisphere in Australia or in Indonesia tomorrow on the 20th just a few hours away there's going to be a rare solar eclipse they're calling this a hybrid eclipse it's a combination of a annular eclipse and a total eclipse once again visible from Australia and down here in Indonesia tomorrow on April 20th coming over here to the homepage of the website today's feature photo was sent in by Kyle S out of Virginia spectacular double decker rainbow and the sky was a very bright purple and pink when he took that photo out of Virginia coming over here to the Space Weather Prediction Center looking at the, the GOES X-ray flux. No major solar flares in the last 72 hours. Looking at the Earth-facing side of the sun. One of the sunspots is shrinking. The other one's maintaining the same size. This active region down here below the equator is also shrinking. So the Earth-facing side of the sun is starting to get a little quiet. Coming over here to poweroutage.us. Right now, the, the power outage situation primarily exists in Hawaii. We don't normally see power outages in Hawaii. Honolulu was showing 20 1,386 customers without electricity. California, 11,800. I believe that the situation in Hawaii involves inclement weather. Hopping over to the Yellowstone Supervolcano Caldera, looking at the seismographs that, that monitor the mighty supervolcano. All in all, pretty quiet. Nothing major going on. A few earthquake signatures up here at Mammoth Vault, but all in all, pretty quiet at the Supervolcano Caldera. And don't forget the, the chance of severe weather today if you're in the Central Plains. This is the, the setup right now. This stage is being set for the possibility of tornadoes, large hail, high winds, and heavy rains in this area right here for the next 48 to 72 hours. Conditions are going to be highly favorable for the formation of severe weather across the central plains. I want to take you guys now down to a, a small island east of Madagascar, slightly north and east of Madagascar, known as Mauritius Island. I received video footage a while ago of something unusual that was observed from from that island in the nighttime sky and here's the video that was shared with me and I'm simply going to share the video with you guys I've never seen anything quite like this in the nighttime sky very bizarre observation and these folks live here on this small island and they've never seen anything like this in the nighttime sky and what makes this even more bizarre it was in the sky for over six hours and this is in 4k what you're looking at here the video was submitted by Chris Sandy Joe back on November 11th of 2020 22 and this is at 10 o'clock at night they notice this unusual object out over the water and you can tell the sky is pitch black out here this is a very remote location out here in the Indian Ocean and this was spotted in the sky again for six hours this is the the object right here that they they kept the camera on off and on for six hours they went back out six hours later at around four o'clock in the morning and it was still there to their surprise. They saw it at 10 o'clock at night, recorded it for a little bit, went back out at 4 o'clock in the morning and recorded it again. So what I did up here at the top, this is a, a split video, I zoomed in up here on the top, down below is the original video. 
What do you make of that thing? I mean, seriously, that looks like some sort of a, a bright orange red flame in the sky, but it's not a, a Chinese lantern. It's not round. It doesn't appear to be moving. It's difficult to say if it's in the same place or not because it's so dark out here. Again, we're looking out over the Indian Ocean here. That's where this object is at, out here somewhere above the Indian Ocean. Look at that. Super weird. I've never had a video from this part of the Earth. And then when I do get a video from this location, it's of some sort of a, a mysterious object in the nighttime sky. Here it is in a simple enhancement. Light is dark, dark is light. And I was looking for any possible features, and I did find some. Sometimes we do when we take away the, the glare. Right there you go. See those features right there? Looks like a round object with something over here on the left. You're going to see it again in, in a slightly different position. And it shows us more features. Look at that right there. That confirms that again that there's something round there with something protruding off of one side or another of this object. Look at that thing. So bizarre. Never seen anything quite like it. So there is a, a physical structure there that was in the sky for many hours off the coast of Mauritius Island in the Indian Ocean. Again, this goes back a, a few months, but it's still relevant. This is weird. I've never seen anything quite like this. Changing colors from orange to red to green. But notice the unusual shape. It's got something in the center that we just saw that looks round right there. You just saw it again. And there is a, a, a physical structure in between all this other stuff that's going on. And the only thing I could come up with for all of these unusual shapes around that object in the center was maybe that object was surrounded by some form of gas and it was creating all these vibrant colors and, and, and different shapes that we're seeing in the sky. Keep in mind, they noticed this at 10 o'clock at night. It could have been there before 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock is when they first noticed it. They got up at 4 o'clock in the morning, went back outside and looked, and it was still there. And I'm assuming... It was in the same part of the nighttime sky. Again, out over the Indian Ocean. Honestly, I've never seen anything quite like this. This is super unique, and it's in a very unique location. I don't think I've ever received a video from the Indian Ocean, from Mauritius Island out in the Indian Ocean, of an unusual object hovering in the sky for most of the night back on November 11th of 2022. And don't forget, keep your eyes peeled to the skies because there could be a large piece of space debris re-entering the atmosphere at any moment as a 660-pound satellite is on its way back into the atmosphere of planet Earth. If you guys have any photos you'd like to share, you can send those to reports at MrMBB333.com. And if you guys have any videos you'd like to share that won't attach to the email for whatever reason, come over here to the homepage of the website, look for this red tab, that says have a large video simply click on the red tab drag and drop your video into the red banner please include your first name date and location and i'll take it from there thanks for watching have a super day and be safe out there